I try. I just try it. Let's see. <laughs> what is this, bro? Are the new and the first ever AFC Showtime players worth it or not? I will show you in this detailed breakdown. Let's go. I will show you how these guys are performing on the pitch, but also comparisons with other versions. I will talk about Khalidu Koulibaly, Engolo Kante, and Cristiano Ronaldo. And to answer you the question, I got all of these players in 121 spins. Don't miss any recommendation, any review. I'm giving lots of tutorials in the offense, in the defense, in the gameplay in general. So don't miss this, guys. Hit the subscribe button. Let's start with Khalidou Koulibaly. First of all, he's a destroyer and can play as a center back on his A position. He's 187 tall and for his height, he's super fast with speeds 76 on the first level and you can level him up to 28 levels. On top, he is really strong, physical contact 84, aggression 83. And if you are adding the booster effect, you can see that his defensive awareness, tackling, acceleration and jumping is increasing. It's a nice booster in my opinion. So this player combines physicality, pace and defense abilities in one. Really rare and really, really good. His weakness is his standard form. Additionally, that his rating will always be on C form, permanent C form, because the AFC Champions League currently yet is not getting any live form update, unfortunately. But maybe that will change in the soon future. We don't know yet. Let's have a look at his skills. He's got every defense skill. From heading and aerial superiority to interception, blocker, fighting spirit, man marking, sliding tackle, captaincy, this guy is complete. He doesn't need any additional skill. It's just a nice to have, but not a must have. The must have he already has. If we're talking about nice to have skills, it would be one touch pass, weighted pass, low lofted pass, pinpoint crossing, and maybe through passing. So just equip him with all the passing skills and he will be a monster. But as I mentioned before, it's not necessary. He doesn't need it. Now I will show you my customized leveling of this player. First of all, I gave him 5 in dexterity to make him faster. Lower body strength plus 5 again. e wheel strength plus 5. And in defending plus 15 because this is the most important section for a defender. So maxed out, he looks like this with my customized leveling, speed 81, acceleration 70, all defense abilities on 90 plus. Let's add him the booster effect. So yeah, super fast, super strong and super good in defense. In the game plan, he looks like this. With the manager boost, with his own boost, speed on 84, it's unreal. Especially this pace combination with his height and his stature, his strength in physical contact 91 i can't wait to see his performance on the pitch guys now let's talk about the probably most valuable player in this selection angolo kante he's a box-to-box -box dmf player but can play as a cmf on his a position too he is really fast really strong in defense and really agile with balance 83 dribbling 78 his passing abilities are high you can level him up 27 levels this guy brings it all and if we are adding the booster you can see defensive awareness tackling speed and stamina are increasing his weakness again is the form standard form permanency rating that is a little problem but he is like a pitbull on the pitch for me kante is the best cmf in game i will also talk about the other kantes the gp and other selection versions and how he is compared to the other players what about his player skills you can see it it's starting with double touch so it's a really nice way to dribble with him one touch pass through pass weighted pass pinpoint crossing unreal unreal man marking interception sliding tackle acrobatic clearance and fighting spirit bellissimo really it's it's my favorite cmf player which additional skills would i give him i would start with blocker then i would give him low lofted pass as a third skill, probably I would give him Mustay turn. As a fourth skill, I would give him cut behind and turn. And as a fifth skill, I would give him outside Perla. Here you can see my customized player progression points for him. Passing 2, dribbling 5, dexterity 6, lower body strength 8, aerial strength 0 and defending 12. And this is how it looks like maxed out. Let's activate his booster and yeah, 
This guy is a beast of a player. All defense abilities on 91 plus. 84 in speed, 83 acceleration, 94 stamina. It's a monster. Let's have a look how he looks like in the game plan. He is here in the CMF position and with the boost, with my leveling, he goes up to 98. Check this out. 87 speed, 85 acceleration, 91 balance. Boy, tackling 98. He will gain back the possession at the back. He will be attacking in the front. He will cover the whole pitch, man. Before I go now into the performance test with N'Golo Kante, I will show you the previous version of the Chelsea selection which was released on the 8th of May. So that we can see how this Kante is compared to the latest Showtime Kante. This is what it looks like. You can also see his ID, his player card, his design under my cam. So let's go for the comparison. Both are same in the characteristics. Everything is equal except the age so the showtime version is just one year older the attacking section you can see attacking awareness plus two ball control minus two dribbling plus five tight possession minus six so the biggest difference here is that one is stronger in dribbling and the other one is stronger in tight possession i think in that position in with these abilities i would prefer the older one because tight possession the close dribblings are more important than going in high speed dribblings. Low pass minus two, lofted pass minus five. So passing is reduced a lot compared to the Chelsea selection. Finishing plus six, heading plus one, set piece taking one plus one. Nice to have, but it's not so impactful. How about pace and area strength and so on? Speed plus one, acceleration plus two, so he is slightly faster than the previous version. Kicking power minus four, physical contact plus 11. That's a huge difference. Physical contact plus 11 is a huge difference. And in my opinion, an N'Golo Kante doesn't need physical contact, but I'm really looking forward to see how this will affect his style on the pitch balance plus one is nice 91 is is huge but still the previous one with 90 is also huge let's talk about the most important section here about the defense so stamina minus one tackling minus one aggression minus two and defensive engagement minus six which is a lot but still his defense abilities are really high at all when i compare them both i would i would consider to take the chelsea version but still, the new one is sensational. Let's compare their player skills now. Player skills wise, they are almost the same. The difference is here that the previous one has got cut behind and turn. And the latest Showtime Kante has got pinpoint crossing. For me, a little advantage for the previous one because I prefer cut behind and turn instead of pinpoint crossing where I'm doing for crosses because I barely do crosses with N'Golo Kante. Statistic wise, the latest Showtime Kante is not as good as the previous Chelsea Selection Kante, but they're almost equal in my opinion, especially the physical contact in plus 11 makes a huge difference, but it doesn't help. So most of the people doesn't have this Kante. Even if they played the game in May and they were trying to get this Chelsea Selection, you had only three chances out of eight. So the probability is not that high that most of the people will have this Kante. Compared to the GP version right now, this Kante is a monster. And in my opinion, he is a must have and he is definitely worth it. Even if you will need to go for 150 bucks, you won't regret to have this Kante in your squad. Last but not least, Cristiano Ronaldo. The only one with a Showtime player skill. In this case, it's phenomenal finishing. Let's have a look. He is the goal poacher, 187 tall, can play on the wings, but also in the center as a center forward and second striker. And what's special on this version is that his acceleration is slightly higher. He's got a really good finishing and he's both footed with his weak foot accuracy very high. So this guy can be a real weapon, especially with the new Showtime skill. I didn't play it. I didn't test it. Can't wait to see his performance on the pitch against real people. His weakness here is his tight possession and his balance. So close and tight dribblings won't be easy with him. He's not designed to make this kind of playstyle on the pitch. How about his skills? Heading, knuckle shot, long range shooting, acrobatic finishing, phenomenal finishing, first time shot, bro. He is bringing almost every shooting skill crazy. 
He's got heel trick, he's got one touch pass, penalty specialist, captaincy, he's got really good player skills. And compared to all the other Ronaldos, these are the best player skills combination for him. As additional skills, I would give him first aerial superiority, double touch to make him more nimble rising shot definitely so so important here maybe the most important one for me as a fourth i would decide between cut behind the turn and Marseille turn depends on you if you're going for lots of dribblings and Marseille turns it would make a lot of sense on him otherwise i would go for cut behind and turn as a fifth skill you can consider to give him super sub especially if you sub this guy in in the second half it can be a huge impact for him Let's check out how he is looking like in the game plan. And you can see that with my customized leveling, he is going on 101 with the boost. And these are his abilities. High attacking awareness, extremely high finishing. And with 19 acceleration, this is by far the fastest Cristiano Ronaldo. Kicking power 93, so his shots will be so, so strong. Before we go into the gameplay, I will compare the old Cristiano Ronaldo, the Portugal national team one, with the latest Showtime version. So, here you go. Right on the right side, you can see the new one. On the left side, the old one. And let's check out his abilities. So, attacking awareness, minus four. Ball control, minus four. Dribbling, plus three. And here, a big difference. Tight possession, minus nine. So with the ball and in the attacking awareness, he's way weaker than previous Ronaldo's. But in the finishing, plus 6. And also his low pass, plus 10. It's a huge difference. So they are completely different in their play styles, in my opinion. Heading minus 7, it's a lot. And set piece taking, plus 5 for the new one. Let's go for the next. Asbacks, and this is curl, plus 3. Speed, plus 1. Acceleration, plus 8. It's a lot. Kicking power plus one. Okay, it's almost the same. Jumping minus nine. Physical contact plus nine. Bro, it's it's really different. Really different. In balance, he's got plus four. In stamina, plus three. And yeah, we don't need to take too much care of the defense. But yeah, in general, the new Ronaldo is way faster and way more clinical. But he is lacking in ball control, tight possession in dribble abilities in general in attacking awareness and also in aerial strength like physical contact and heading let's see what he will do on the pitch man so with this team now i will go into the afc champions league event it's a nice flair it's a nice intro nice scoreboard i love that atmosphere it's authentic in my opinion so we will try them out now against real people with cristiano ronaldo angolo kante and Kalidou Koulibaly. We will test all of them three. Let's start with the first game, guys. We are about getting an opponent. Yes, here you go. Five bars. Exact. Okay, Kutso. I know this name from somewhere. Let's see. Maybe he is good. Al Nasser versus Al Ittihad, bro. Classico. How was the form of the players? Koulibaly, good form. Kante, C form. Ronaldo, C form. Perfect. Here you go, bro. Usually I would play with counter target on Cristiano Ronaldo on my center forward, but I leave it that we can see his typical and normal behavior without any individual instruction. Bismillah. Here you go, Bismillah. Let's try. Okay. Why not? Koulibaly with the first aerial duel. And he is winning it. But Brozovic is messing it up. Cristiano. Cristiano. But the tight possession is not here. Koulibaly. Good first impression from him. Let's go for the knock-on. Was not good performed for me, not good executed. Dante, really present, really active here on the pitch. Good dribblings, good turns. To Cristiano. To the long corner. Ah, 
Ah, come on! Nice cool production here from the latest Showtime players. Koulibaly! Always right. Nice positioning here from him. And again, Koulibaly. Bro, wow. Wow, wow, wow. Nice pass here from Angolo. Nice turn. I just want Ronaldo, bro. Just want Ronaldo. Yes, bro. And here you go, Cristiano. With his nice acceleration. He breaks through. Bro, I like that. Koulibaly always correct. Nice positioning from him. Here you go. I'm telling you, he's winning every duel in the back, bro. Wow. This pace from Kante. Ah, come on. Really strong behavior here from Kante. Come on. And Kalidou Koulibaly with his pace. Oh, that was not bad, bro. Ante again with the intercept. Ante, Kante. Okay, that's fine for me. Nice pass here from Cristiano with his one touch pass into the short corner. Come on. Was not bad. Kalidou Koulibaly made a great job. Great job. Same for Kante. GG's! Zero shots on my goal. I've had 11 shots. <laughs> Let's check the opponent's ranking, guys. I think it was not too bad. Top 5,700 was his highest. Okay. Okay. I've expected a little more, but it's fine. GG. Let's go for another one. Four bar opponent. Exact. Okay, here you go. Al Nasser versus Al Nasser. This time I will give counter target on Cristiano Ronaldo to keep him up in the front. And Bismillah, let's go. All right, I'm in the blue kits. Opponent in the yellow home kits. What? Shoo! Bro, that was the phenomenal finishing. From this angle, bro, from this position, that monster shot. Shut up and take my money, bro. What? Not bad. Not bad. The next one, bro. The next one. Smash it, bro. Smash it. That's a pen. That's a pen referee. Here you go, bro. Cristiano with the head trick. Aim to the corner. Full speed, 100%. Boom! Cristiano. Did you see that, bro? Bam, like that. What? Hey, bro, this phenomenal finishing on Ronaldo is insane. Four goals in 10 minutes. Come on, stop it, bro. Stop it. I try. I just try it. Let's see. <laughs> what is this, bro? Oh my gosh. Every shot is a goal, bro. Every shot is a goal. Ante here with the intercept, gaining back the possession for us. Ante is one of a kind. Oh, this acceleration! What, bro? Holy! Bro, this pace in combination with that finishing makes him deadly. That makes him deadly, bro. Can 
Can we smash with Cristiano? <laughs> Every shot is a goal. This guy is not normal, man. Seven goals from Cristiano. In first off. Look at this dashboard, bro. <laughs> I want to see that banger, bro. That one from the wing here. I think it's this one. What? No way this... <laughs> <laughs> bro this is so impressive man it's so so impressive unreal palido with the intercept as always always great positioning from him the thing is i'm talking always about his clinicalness from cristiano ronaldo but his passes are so wild man kante kante and again kante bro that was my mistake. Kalidu Koulibaly. Yeah, he's winning, of course, the E-Real duel. From Kalidu, we need you. And he's here. Two Angolo Kante, bro. Nice. Kalidu, Kalidu, Kalidu. And it's again Koulibaly, bro. Don't do this with Cristiano, bro. Don't do this with Cristiano! Don't worry. Kalidu and Kante are here, bro. Kante to Cristiano. Oh, great pass. Great goal. He made it good. Kante! Yes, he is able to get back the ball. GG's. Eight goals and all of them, all eight goals with Cristiano Ronaldo, bro. Unbelievable. Let's check the opponent's ranking right now. Division 2, what is Max? Though not a noob, but yeah. <laughs> Cristiano Ronaldo showed him his limits. I have a good first impression now of all these players, but I want to go for a last third game to make my performance test and to let you know about everything what i feel and notice on the pitch bismillah come kalidu win this for me come kalidu and kalidu koulibaly is here of course to kante who is initiating the counter attack kante look at this pace bro Stunning shot! Boah! Go for the knock-on shot. That's unreal. Insane. Both footed, bro. Weak foot accuracy, very high. First, he is going for smashing the post, bro. And then with the knock-on shot with his weak foot. Unbelievable. Kalidu! It saved me, bro. Come, Kante. To initiate the counter-attack, bro. Nice one. And the next one. And the next one. Oh boy. Kalidu Koulibaly. Yes, bro. It's mine. He's gaining back the possession. So good with his positioning. With his dual behavior. Unreal. Ante. The initiator of my counter-attacks. Yeah, look at this nimbleness, bro. Here you go, once again. Can you see how he's speeding up my attack? He's speeding up the counter-attack so fast, bro. We need Kante to speed up the game. Look at this, bro. In no time, in no time, he is just at the front. Making the assist, bro. It's so, so good. And look how he's dashing back, bro. In the next second, he's in the defense. He is so extraordinary, bro. Halidu, always great positioning here. Great, 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 great. Kante, yes, here you go. And to the front once again. Kalidu, we need you. Kalidu, we need you. Well, that was not bad, not bad, bro. Good pass. 
Good pass. Yeah, make your celebration. It's fine. Cristiano Ronaldo on both sides. Come, come, take. Come. Come, my people. Look at this pace. Look at this aggression, bro. And this nimbleness. He's unbelievable. <laughs> Crazy. Crazy. Oh, oh, bro. I'm really impressed, man. His shots are out of this world, man. Conte is so agile, bro. So, so active on the pitch. Look at this, bro. Unstoppable. On top with the double touch. So, so OP. And that was not even a stunning. It was just a normal shot. I've never seen this before. Phenomenal finishing, bro. What are you talking, man? Phenomenal finishing. Ciao. Rage quit, bro. Ibla. Ibla. I'm curious, guys. Let's check the goals and appearances of Cristiano Ronaldo. I just want to see that. Three appearances. You can see it on the left side. And 14 goals, bro. Against only human beings. It's, it was not against the AI. Bro, bro, he is he's a monster. Are these Showtime players worth it or not? Let's answer the question now. Khalidou Koulibaly, for me, is a sensational player really rock solid center back but his big minus is his standard form and his permanent c rating as a center back it could be a little critical on the pitch he really impressed me and he satisfied me also with his performances so i will give him a rating out of 10 1 to 10 i will give him a 8 definitely a solid eight angolo kante for me is the best cmf in game kante in general i would also recommend you to play with the gp kante but this one is of course way stronger than the gp kante and almost similar just a little weaker than the chelsea selection one but yeah this guy is definitely worth it to go 100 percent. i wanted to say 150 percent 150 bucks guys but yeah he is so active, nimble on the pitch, always gaining back the possession, speeding up your counter-attacks, initiating your counter-attacks. So you will find him in the front in the attack, you will find him in the back in the defense. This guy is everywhere. My rating for Kante is a 8.5. I would also go to almost 9. With unwavering form, bro, this guy is close to a 10. But standard form C rating, 8.5 monster player monster player cristiano ronaldo bro you saw it with your own eyes he is smashing every ball into the net right foot left foot stunning shots unreal with this acceleration he feels way more nimble than the other cristiano ronaldo's for me this is the best version out of him and he's different than romario mbappe hoimison and these regular players you know having this kind of player this type of player at least on your bench to give your gameplay a change when your gameplay is not the best when the connection is too heavy when you need a different approach this one is a real game changer fantastico he will get an 8.5 from me habibis thanks for watching if you like this kind of videos this reviews let me know hit the like button also let me know in the comments about which topic you want me to talk next i will leave you with a nice and smooth Bye!